an opportunity to take a you know a deeper dive uh, into some of the areas. And, and one of the big areas that we saw was world equity funds. They did absolutely fantastic as far as returns went. About 17.66 percent for the year uh, year to date return. People were doing a lot of bottom shopping at the time. But really, we can go down the whole spectrum of equity funds. And at the bottom, mixed asset funds. Those are our target date funds that are have fixed income and equity. 11.15 percent. So for the year, we had some really good numbers all the way across the board. Of interest, though, was taking a look at some of the new bloomers that came out. Industrials were up 7.6 percent. Uh, that'd be industrial funds. Base metal funds, uh, base material funds were actually up about 4 and about 0.15 percent. So these areas, I think, are the ones that were recent bloomers and may have some legs going forward. I want to ask you, too, when we look forward, we know that in uh, 2012, equity funds trounced the bond funds in terms of performance, yet your preliminary data shows retail investors in December put money into bond funds, took it out of stock mutual funds. Listen, is this the year that that finally reverses and we start to see a real pickup in inflows in the equity funds? You know, I think there will be some performance chasing. We have this happen each and every year that we have really good performance. People are late to the party. We saw this in, uh, you know, 2003 and 2004 when we had some really spectacular returns. And I'm afraid that we may see a little bit of that. But I think we've seen a, a fundamental shift in investor attitude. And I think investors are going to stay pat. They are scared and they're staying scared. Our uh, pessimistic uh, pundits out there are basically, you know, telling them how bad things are going to get, that we're going to have continued problems with the government, trying to come up with now a new budget ceiling coming up in February. So I think they're going to sit pat. But we do expect that there is going to be some performance for equity funds and an opportunity to jump in. I don't know that we're going to see a follow-through by the average retail investor, though.